Denmark, country number 44. Look at that, another big bridge. I think is, uh, is the bridge that will take me to the main island in, uh, in Denmark, at least. What I consider the main island because it's the one with the capital. There's free shelters everywhere in Copenhagen, in uh, Denmark, sorry. I still don't understand what those shelters are, but we will see tonight what the shelter. And there is an app that is called shelter.dk that you can download on your phone and you can see all the shelters that are freely available in Denmark on the map. And there's quite a lot. I will arrive tomorrow to Copenhagen and still haven't found a host in Copenhagen. I sent about 300 requests in Couchsurfing and I think everybody on warm showers. I got a, a, a reply from a lady on warm showers. She can host me Sunday and Monday, but not Saturday, not tomorrow. So decision, decision. I think uh, they are building a tunnel connecting the two islands. The girl that you saw at the, on the bridge, she's, uh, she's touring. She has been touring for a few weeks. Uh, Sweden, Germany, uh, Germany, Sweden, uh, Denmark. Now she's back in Germany. She's from Bavaria and she would like to cycle around the world. And uh, she is the only girl, lady, woman, that I ever seen <laughs> on a cycling day with a summer dress. She was super fashionable, but she saw me under the dress, she showed me under the dress she had like her padded shorts. And she told me she was wearing the dress because uh, there is a festival in this town and she's been there like a few hours. People of the road. Even tonight I arrived at my host before the rain. Yesterday, 10 minutes before. I think here it will be another hour. Good morning. Off I go to Copenhagen. Yesterday I took a day off. It was raining uh, all day. So my host uh, told me I could stay a day here because there is a festival. And we went to the theater. We see, we saw a few performances and uh, it all worked out great because uh, because it was raining uh, all day so today it should be cloudy and there should be a few showers in the middle of the day but for the most part it should be dry it stopped raining about two hours ago it rained the whole night and yeah I'm 20 kilometers from uh, Copenhagen, from my host in Copenhagen. And uh, an event for day, I managed not to get wet. And here in Copenhagen, there is a bit of sun. But before getting to Copenhagen, I wanted to show you a little bit the seaside. Let's go to the beach, if we can, if there is a trail to the beach. The problem is the fucking hotel bags rattling. I can't believe hotel haven't figured out a way to 
out the panniers in a better way. I mean, Germany engineers, they could have done better. Very, very sandy. Let's see. Let's see if I can pedal. And this is the ocean, guys. Temperature, not too cold. The sun is shining, kinda. Let's see if we can do a panoramic. I like the beach, it's uh, underdeveloped, very natural. It's nice. in a suburb north of Copenhagen where my host lives and it got pretty <laughs> cloudy and dark and probably it's gonna rain soon and uh, it got a bit chilly as well the wind uh, I don't know why but it got chilly here this is the marina and this morning i left uh, copenhagen i didn't do much touristy stuff i didn't go through the the center of copenhagen i've seen it already i've been in copenhagen many times for business in the past so um yeah i didn't need to to see the city center to be honest and i was uh, a little outside and i just want to chill a little bit i We'll reach today Sweden. We will cross it in a, in a couple of hours. This is a ferry, and basically, yeah, you, I'm not sure if you see land on the other side. That's Sweden. I will get to Helsingborg, and I arrange uh, two new wheels to get shipped to Helsingborg. So I'll, and DHL kind of fucked up a little bit, and uh, I have to wait uh, an extra day, which I didn't want to wait because. Uh, yeah, so basically I went slow because I knew that the, the wheels were coming and uh, I kind of lost two days, two, three days I will lose with this thing. The wheels, if you remember, they, start, they started to crack when I was in Turkey. You can see a crack here. And on the, on the front wheel as well, there are uh, several cracks. And then, uh, if you remember, these are uh, WTB scraper I 45 I think and um, and then WTB sent me two replacement rims the COM TUF or KOM TUF but in the midst of the, the lockdown those rims went lost uh, I shipped them to, to buy cafe uh, to make a, to make two new wheels and, uh, and they kind of got lost um, there was some lost the communication was not very well from my part, I think. And um, so by Cafe made me two new wheels uh, before I started the trip in July. And they shipped them to my, to my house. But the problem was that the, the wheels had the wrong type of hubs. So they had the, the true axle hubs. But my, my hubs are uh, with a quick release. So I could have adapted the front one with an adapter, but the, the back one was uh, the size of the hub was just too big for my bike. So I sent them back and then, uh, and then they got two new hubs, I think, and they, and they made the wheels, but uh, there, there's a, there are shortages of, uh, of spare parts for, uh, for bikes. So it was not very easy to find uh, some decent hubs. Yeah, so I just started my trip without the new wheels and now they were ready. So I knew someone that lives close to Helsingborg in Sweden and I shipped uh, the wheels uh, there. That's my story. I'm going to have a bit of breakfast here. I have some bread and uh, enjoy a little bit the view and then uh, continue to... I will get to Helsingborg where I get a ferry 
to Sweden. It's a very short ferry. Uh, I will take the ferry soon. But I almost forgot to, to get a beer for the to have the cap to put on my bike. Got the cap, it's a Swaniki slow beer. So I drink it slow. Cheers. I have a bicycle sign. That's where I'm going. Hi. Hello. Bicycle. Yeah, one way. One way please, yeah. Uh, 445 and lane number 8. Thank you. This is 6 euro 05. Fellow bike travelers. Let's see if they want to socialize or not. Yeah. Today we were very Hello. But it was a very long day from that piece of Okay, we're going on. Hi. Hi. Okay. Well, these traps are expensive as fuck. But they're kind of useful to have on a, on a long bike. So this is secure, even if the ferry shakes. 